So what we're gonna do ultimately is make a greenhouse out of plastic water bottles. So that's what they're doing back there. So what you're seeing here is a combined project between Arvada West High School and Foster Elementary here in Arvada. Arvada West asked all their students to uh, donate all the reusable water bottles. And we collected them and donated them here. I'm with this club, Peace Jam, and we decided that this year we would build a greenhouse out of water bottles so that we could help the school garden club start planting in the winter. Peace Jam's the world's largest youth development organization led by Nobel Peace Laureates. Kids study the life and work of the laureate, develop leadership skills, and uh, learn about global issues. I think it's cool that we can use the plastic water bottles for something other than like pollution or something that can help the environment instead of ruin it. We might as well use them. They're going to live in our environment for 700 years, so they might as well live in a greenhouse. When you're building these, yeah. when you're building these, make sure that the label's at the bottom. You got it at the top. As you can see, it's not like teachers, it's kids like my age. And they're doing, they're like building this greenhouse, not because they were forced to, but because they wanted to come here and donate their time on a Saturday to build this greenhouse for our community. I think that this is a great way to spend our Saturday instead of just sitting around. It gives you like a sense of commitment that you're, um, that you're actually doing something to like for your community. First of all, the kids, it's a true service learning club, so they get to, to decide themselves what project they'd like to do. And they've been doing service projects here for many years. This is the first year I came to the club and said, would you consider a project? I'm pleased that they chose to do the project that I um, asked for. There is a strong tradition of gardening here at Foster. We have families come out during the summer and tend the garden, and we will have a youth farmer's market in the fall when the kids come back from school. We'll have a place to keep things warm until the ground is warm enough and that we are not under freeze warning in order to plant our tomatoes. It's fun to grow your own things, and I think it's fun that we get to build a greenhouse to grow things in. This is our first partnership with another Peace Jam Club, and it's very exciting to have the high school students come help us. We also have help from Home Depot. They're the ones who gave us like all the wood and materials and stuff like that. Uh, they feel fulfilled that they're making a difference and changing people's uh, um, ideals and perception of how small acts can make a big difference.